up you guys and welcome back to our channel i know that i have been gone for some months it's like the pandemic came and your girl just got off the face of the earth when it came to youtube um i am so sorry for that y'all but i am back this time um and i'm really and truly back because i have a better understanding so but nonetheless before i jump into all of that welcome back to our channel y'all i am so excited to be back for those of you who do not know who i am my name is danielle bailey and i'm a licensed clinical social worker who decided to make a youtube channel to document her journey through entrepreneurship um for one year and it has continued so 2019 was the first full year of entrepreneurship here i am into 2020 going into the second year of entrepreneurship and i am blessed like i cannot describe it any other way i am blessed um so nonetheless you guys i know i've been gone and i know y'all are like danielle where have you been um truth be told i really I really was doing a lot, okay? Like, I was doing podcasting, I was doing YouTube, I was doing some of everything, but I none of them was producing. All of them was their own separate entity. And this is, I want to tell y'all this. When you start off in trying to do entrepreneurship, trying to find your niche, whatever it is that you're trying to do, I want you to give yourself room to try to figure this thing out because that's what I needed. I needed room to figure things out. I needed rooms to try stuff. If it didn't work, if it didn't do that, I needed that. And then I needed time to sit still and think about what it is that I'm doing and pray and all this other kind of stuff. So um, that's kind of like why I took a hiatus because I really did not know one, let me, one, first of all, my camera, it just, it just messed up. Like, yo, I couldn't upload videos. Two, I did not know the direction of what I wanted to go. I know I was doing a whole bunch of stuff and nothing was being, um, I was doing a whole bunch of stuff, but nothing was bringing in clients or, or anything of that nature. I was just doing. So, um, that's why I kind of took a break on the on the actual youtube um videos and stuff like that until i actually got an understanding of what it is that i want to do with this channel and so i really and truly got an understanding of it i want to say about may towards the end of may and or maybe it was the beginning of may i'm not sure so first off since i've been gone on my hiatus um the currently building generational wealth is actually a business now so Okay, I have opened up a second business, a second stream of income, um, which is the Currently Building Generational Wealth brand. Um, at first, I was trying to do the financial therapy up under my private practice, Freedom Therapy Center, but they just was not aligning. So I wanted to separate the two and make them their own businesses. They are their own business. So Freedom Therapy LLC is its own business and Currently Building Generational Wealth it's its own LLC as well. How that came about, <laughs> God was God. God just d deposited it in my spirit, and because I, I wanted to separate the money, like I wanted to get an understanding of how much freedom was bringing in and how much currently building generational wealth and was bringing in or not bringing in or the lack thereof. Because currently building generational wealth is still an up and going business. It's still a business that needs to grow. So it was taken from freedom. Okay, so you see why I say I need to separate. So I have officially LLC, currently building generational wealth. I am excited about that move and stuff like that. So what's going to happen with the YouTube channel? I'm going to tell you. So since I have separated the two, Freedom Therapy Center is its own entity and currently building generational wealth is its own entity. Currently building generational wealth would house all of my social media content so what that means is when i say house i mean my youtube channel is going to fall up on the currently building generational wealth my podcast is going to fall up on the currently building generational wealth too so names will be changing okay <laughs> i know y'all are just like wow they yeah so the youtube channel will probably change as long as i am able to change these things without much trouble i am as long as i'm able to change my podcast i will change it to currently building generational wealth youtube channel will be currently building generational wealth as well 
It will go from Danielle Bailey LCSW to actually currently building generational wealth. And the reason why I am changing it to that, because I am going to document why and how I'm building generational wealth. I like, yo, like when God had dropped that on me, y'all may be like, Danielle, that is so simple. But to me, that is exciting because it housed so much because I just could not figure out like what to talk to y'all about. Like I know that my other videos was telling y'all about how to open up a private practice and how to do that. Like, yeah, that's good, but that's not what I'm all about now. Like now I'm about building generational wealth. Like this t-shirt is just not a t-shirt. And by the way, if you want to buy a t-shirt, you can, I will link the, the uh, put the link in the description box below, but this is a movement. This is a mood. This is who I am. I want to teach people about how to build generational wealth, the importance of building generational wealth, why we need to build generational wealth. And that's what I'm here for now. Like, yo, I'm excited about it. And I hope that you guys can actually feel the excitement. So, like, I'm going to show you guys the ups and the downs of building generational wealth. And one of the most important videos that I'm going to do this coming up, I'm going to hopefully I can upload this video, which is Monday, June 15th, um, 2020. I'm going to talk about, I'm going to upload another video on this coming Friday and I'm going to talk about how I tried something, how I, in the journals and the planners, okay? Did I tell y'all that? Did I show y'all the journals and the planners? I want to tell you guys about that adventure, okay? Scare money, don't make no money, okay? You got to spend money to make money. And I want to talk about the ups and the downs of trying to build generational wealth, okay? Like, I want to take you guys... I feel like I can create more and I hope I'm making sense right now. Okay. I really hope I am making sense because I like feel like I'm all over the place by me changing the name to currently building generational wealth. It gives me so much to show. I can show you guys when I was just saying that I'm trying to open up a private practice. I felt like I was limited to that. But when I'm talking about currently building generational wealth, that encompasses so much more. You can see my ups and my downs. You can see me trying different things that, that work, that may not work. You can, like all of that. And I'm so excited about this new journey with the currently building generational wealth brand and the movement that we're moving to. So this Friday, I should drop another video and it's going to be about, I'm just going to come out with the heavy hitter about the planners and the journals that I actually um, did. The good, the bad, and the ugly about that. How I lost money. But what I learned. Okay? The journal, I'm not, I'm not going to say that the journals or the planners that I created was a big flop because they were not. They were a great learning experience and it's unfortunate that I had to spend so much to learn at that but it's what I needed like I needed to do the project the project is actually has come to a, um, a halt so y'all stay tuned to figure out what happened with the journals and the planners I will talk about that on Friday and um yeah so y'all I'm excited if y'all are excited please let me know what y'all want to talk about and all that other great stuff. So, nonetheless, thank y'all so much for being, um, subscribing to this channel. Make sure you tell people about the channel. It's not just about, um, building a private practice anymore. It's about building generational wealth. That's what it's about now. How are we going to build this generational wealth? How are we going to get to these dollars? Okay? Nonetheless. So, nonetheless, thank y'all so much. I love you guys. This is not a channel. Let me make sure. Let me make this last statement. This is not a channel about being money hungry neither or any of things of that. It is a channel about me going through my um, journey about um, of how to build generational wealth with God. Um, some of the things that I'm doing right now, I have a 21 day fast going on with people. 21 days fasting. I want to talk about that. And so it's a, it's a channel to really and truly still show because a lot of people think that God and money don't mix. God and money does mix. Okay. It's a, it's a channel to show 
how I'm building the generational wealth and how God is assisting me, how I'm assisting other people as well too. And some of the bad thoughts that I have too. And when I mean about bad thoughts, I mean like some of the thoughts that I struggle with, like how, how helping people, how giving away free things. Okay. Let me see how giving away free things is going to help me generate income. Like I didn't, I don't understand the two. God want me to give this away for free, but then I'm like, how am I going to generate income? How do you generate income by giving stuff away for free? Huh? Help me. Help me understand, okay? How do I give away stuff for free and generate income? Yeah, I don't know, okay? So, I'm still trying to figure that out. I'm still waiting on God to deposit it into me. and But he has been keeping me. I have not missed a bill. Or anything like that one thing I'm gonna talk about too look I got some topics some videos that's coming out the rip y'all hear me when I say these videos are coming out the rip I'm gonna tell y'all about how I skipped my student loan payments to invest and currently build a generational wealth y'all if anybody know me know that my student loans like me trying to pay them off is 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 for real i might do a video on student loans too about because they can hinder your generational wealth um they can hinder your gen generational wealth progress as well so do y'all see i'm able to talk about so much more by currently building generational wealth okay nonetheless y'all i'm about to here because y'all know i say 15 minutes or less on these videos thank y'all so much for staying down with your girl um new videos will be coming out soon Thank y'all so much. I'll talk to y'all later. Love y'all. Bye.